let us take those who are among the smallest and most credulous of us, force them to awake around the hour of seven each dawn, and march into the depths of frosty seasons on rush hour roads. This edition of the Ridley Report is brought to you by ShireSociety.com. Join up and move to New Hampshire for more freedom. Ah, uh, here is a here is a proposal with great potential for liberating an afflicted humanity from its many woes. <coughs> Let us take those who are among the smallest and most credulous of us, force them to awake around the hour of seven each dawn, and march into the depths of frosty seasons, on rush hour roads, toward assigned gathering posts. <coughs> <coughs> This, roughly two hundreds of times per annum. There, it would be their duty to await the arrival of collective, unseat-belted driving machines. Perhaps transported, as in my own case, to the opposite sides, uh, uh, ghettoed sides, of cities, for purposes of national social reconstruction. Upon arrival, each people could easily uh, be pent with other, with other local youth, uh, fixing themselves to uh, desks for the majority of the day, where they would be trained by union constituents, largely undismissible from their employ, and uh, who, but they nevertheless to possess loyalty uh, toward their detainees, would be discouraged by policy and imperial statute from effectively defending them. Only on uh, rare occasions should there be any expectation for a uh, deranged gunman to enter the training camp uh, but in the event that this were to occur, as it has only hundreds of times, uh, the disarmament of all of the participants should help at least ensure uh, the safety of the attacker. Should this intruder up on the scene, and despite his government-enhanced safe passage status, elects to discharge his firearm, there is every possibility he shall meet a squadron of, uh, of random twelve-year-olds, uh, formidably uh, um, accoutred with uh, pencils, hockey pucks, uh, perhaps even uh, door locks. There is great hope that if any of these instruments happen to be wielded uh, by a, a jiu-jitsu master or comic strip hyperhero, uh, they may be of, of some effect against the enemy. Only on the off occasion would, uh, would surveys of an intimate and probing nature be uh, administered to these juniors, and on, uh, on, uh, on some occasions, despite abandoning them to the whims of the, the Monopoly training camp, uh, parents would even be notified of the information gatherings, uh, or no matter, uh, perhaps, uh, or, or perhaps very, very few uh, matters, would students uh, be in any way pressured uh, to inform upon their parents? Um, the number so informed on globally during the last century, uh, known as it is to be well under 50 millions, those are uh, well under 50 millions. <coughs> Those belonging to religious families, uh, wary of idolatry, <coughs> would, um, mm. 
religious, uh, at least no matter, perhaps very few, those belong, those belonging to uh, religious families wary of idolatry are otherwise uh, resisting presentations of, of fealty towards secular symbols would, um, the secular symbols are, uh, you know, crap cannons, where's the, uh, the belonging, would, but under no circumstances uh, be, be lifted up out of their seats and forced to hold a standing position during the incantations. This would surely not occur, except on the occasion where it happened to the spirited young anarchist Eli Eastman of Peterborough, New Hampshire. Ah, uh, further, uh, further enhancing the, uh, the auspicious nature of this regimen would be formidable strictures against uh, the ability of independent or skeptical observers to monitor in person those workings and effectiveness levels of the facility, facilities. <coughs> even, even attempts to photograph the authoritarian sloganeering on the walls during school board meetings and while the classes are not in session uh, could be made and has been made a problematic. If you love liberty, declare your independence by signing the Shire Society Declaration at ShireSociety.com.